Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Naked brand beverages. These are both uh, juices. This is a Mighty Mango Juice and Pina Colada. And I have smoothies. This one is the Orange Vanilla Cream and the Key Lime. The tall bottles were $2.99 each at Kroger. These chunkier bottles were $3.18 each at Walmart. I didn't get cups out because you can see through the mm -hmm. bottle. You can see what color they are, so I figure that's good enough. Uh, we're gonna try the uh, the mango mighty mango first. And we're just gonna drink after each other. We're married. Oh yeah, I did. Yeah, we could have done. I mean, why? I don't care. Um, blend of five juices, partially from concentrate with added ingredients and other natural flavors. No sugar added. The it uh, it says no sugar added, not a low calorie food. A lot of things say that that are that are no sugar added. They say not a low calorie food. The goodness inside, no preservatives added, no sugar added, gluten-free, vegan, juices from one and a fourth mangoes, one and three-fourths apples, a half an orange, a third of a banana, and a hint of lemon. I like that they do that, kind of like the RX bars give you like yes, two, exactly. three almonds and you know. <laughs> but you know, um, a lot of people think because they're uh, eating fruit, or I know somebody who would like just get a can of fruit and eat the whole can of fruit thinking that was healthy. Um, this is 290 calories. If you're looking for fun. calories, it's not calories. If you're looking for, yes, I count calories, so that's all that I care about. If you're looking for all the other, if you're calculating out your Nutrients, diet, then, then that's a right. different thing. <laughs> that's different, but if you're like me and you do calories, this is 290 calories. It says shake yeah, well. It's we been shaken. I shook them. shook them all. Um, so these are uh, distributed by Naked Juice Company in Irvine, California. And in our um, in our stores, we bought them in the produce area and in every store they've been in the produce area. Produce, and they're, yeah. They're cold. They're, you have to buy them cold. You don't buy them room temperature. It looks very thick. I think you'll like it. I like it. And it is thick. That is really nice. It's not bad. It's sweet. It tastes like, uh, it has a little bit of a grapefruity flavor, just a touch, but not bad. It's mostly no. a peachy mango kind of flavor. That's what it, to me, it's more. It's almost nectarine like. See, to me, it's more peach than no. anything. I bet mangoes a lot of times come across to, to us both as, yeah. as peach. It's um, not as peachy as it is full on mango though, mm, <laughs> truthfully. To me, the, the, the strongest thing in there, it tastes like peaches. Um, to be completely honest, I was terrified to drink that because I thought, hmm, a bottle of orange juice. What, you know, what are we gonna think of that? I actually like it's it. It's good, I would drink it. If I did not count, if well, I don't count calories right now to be honest, but I do, I'm mindful of calories, okay? So I don't drink my calories. If I didn't mind drinking my calories, I would drink that. Yeah, it's very, very good. It'd be like drinking a, a bottle of orange juice. Or right, which juice I wouldn't do that either. Um, I only drink zero but that's calories. A, this is similar. But it's it just similar, a, yes. Yeah. Uh, this is thicker though. Is the pina colada. I'm really excited about this mm -hmm. one. I love pina colada. It has um, a, ha a, sorry, a third pineapple, a th three fourths of an apple, a fourth of a uh, banana, a fifth of an orange with coconut milk and a hint of lemon. 290 calories. Okay. I just get it started. That's my job. Hmm. Oh, wow. Now, I love that. That's when I drink all the time. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah. Only because it's really pineapple juice on us. It yes. Mostly yes. pineapples, the main flavor. Then I get coconut too. And it's 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 a little not thick. Coconut, I get a little I, banana. I don't want to say that it's uh, like a milkshake, mm -hmm. but it's a little. Um, it's thicker than just. Um, pineapple uh, juice out of a can. It, it has a, a thicker consistency, but then it's not like a milkshake or something. No, like it's that. not that thick. It's very sweet. It's very, very sweet. It's yes. really, I mean, if you ever drink pineapple juice, that it's as sweet as that. Yeah. I can understand why it's so many calories though. 
it's more than a candy bar. I mean, it, yeah. let's just be well, frank. It's, it's, it's more than a cola or anything. Uh huh. Yeah. It's it, but it's really really good. Mm -hmm. And I'm wondering um, if most of the times when people drink these, um, are you drinking like like if you were to get a can of Coke, you would drink the whole can of Coke yeah. in short time. Do you do that with these two, or do you try to pace yourself with them? Is what I'm, you know, like a little bit here, a little bit there. And then or is this something you drink in the morning to, re to replace your breakfast? Your breakfast. Oh, good yeah. idea. It's not going to be very filling, though. That's good the idea. That, yeah. That this one actually says it has uh, 45 milligrams of vitamin C. So this is a vitamin C, yeah. That's awesome. Too. Yeah. Um, Excellent. And you do get a little coconut, too. Yeah, I love that. We drink it all the time. Uh, this is orange vanilla cream. Flavored almond milk smoothie with other natural flavors and ingredients. Let's see. Delicious dessert inspired smoothies. No preservatives added. Excellent source of vitamin C. Vegan, gluten free. Um, naked orange vanilla cream is a delicious twist on your favorite dessert. Um, boosted with vitamin C. This creamy blend of smooth plant-based milks. Tasty fruits and luscious vanilla will satisfy your sweet tooth. It is 260 calories. Now, both of these had 100% juice. This one says 61% juice. Well, it has milk. Since which since. is still a lot of juice because if you look at like, <laughs> I just can't get it. If you look at the fruit juices, I could get it, but I would tear my hand. Um, if you look at fruit juices, most a lot of them say no juice. Or 10%. Or, yeah, hardly anything. So this is still a really yeah. high percentage. That's why it's perishable. You have to keep them cold. Oh, that tastes That's like good. a creamsicle. Tastes just like a creamsicle. Oh, and they said dessert inspired. It is. And all. It is. It, it, it's just like a creamsicle. Yeah, it's not, qu it's not quite as... Uh, sweet. Sweet, and it's not quite as strong on orange. I think I it's pretty strong. Language. It's pretty strong. The vitamin C on that one, this one was 45 milligrams. What's that one? Uh, where are you even seeing that? It'd be down here. It, it has vitamin, oh, vitamin C? Yeah. It, it's 117 milligrams. Oh, that's a lot. Um, I, I like that, but creamsicle is not like a flavor I want all the time. I would get tired of it. Mm -hmm. So I really do think very good. It's, it's very, very nice, but I would choose the pineapple yeah, over that one. Uh, this one is more of the vanilla ice cream part. Yes. With a little bit of the orange. Yeah. And it's not as orange as it is. You know, vanilla, you say that, and I, I understand what you're saying, but I still think the orange is plenty strong. Oh, yeah, the orange is strong enough, but most of the flavor I get is the vanilla ice cream part. This is key lime, a flavored almond milk smoothie, partially from concentrate with other natural flavors. I bet this one says the same thing. Um, yeah, it's a twist on your favorite dessert. It, it's vegan and gluten-free and all that. This one is 220 calories. This one has 45% juice. So it has the lowest juice out of, out of all of these. I don't know if I'd want a lot of key lime juice in there anyway. <laughs> I would not want to eat just a key lime. It's not bad. It's it, not bad. It's my least favorite of the Yeah, bunch. definitely my least favorite of the bunch. It, it is what it tastes like, though. I mean, it is what it says it is. It tastes like what it says. It tastes like key lime. It does. It does taste like key lime. It's not as, like, syrupy, syrupy sweet, like, as a pie, but it's still really good. But it still is sweet. You know, mm -hmm. we've had a lot of key lime pies, and it is sweet. It's just that normally when you're eating a, a piece of pie, you're getting the crust The as crust well. adds a lot. Yeah. And the crust adds a lot of that really uh, good experience to it. This is just the key lime without the crust or the the um, Cool Whip, yeah. you know. And so it's, it's, it's strong is what it, it is. is. It's it strong is. because you're not getting that crust mixed in. That, so that would be the one that I would pass on, but if you love key lime, like if you're eating it out of a bowl and you're not eating it with crust anyway, you'll probably really love that. If you like lime, I think you'd like that. Well, it's, it tends to be, it's a little, uh, it's missing that sharpness that a key lime has though. You know, yeah. a key lime has that like very tart sharpness. Yeah, this doesn't it have It doesn't have that. No. Um, both of us, our favorites, definitely oh, yeah, going to be the pineapple. Um, but, really good. yeah, you need to watch the dates on these. 
because uh, we were in a store. Uh, well, I told you where I bought them. I bought them at Kroger. Um, so, I mean, why not, why not just tell you? We were in Kroger, and they had uh, bottles up front that had already expired like weeks ago. And then they had the newer bottles, these bottles, in the back. And I tell you how you could act, how I actually knew to even look at the date. I'm glad I did, was because they had separated. So these particular bottles, they if you looked at them, they were a clear up here, and then all the stuff had gone down. Which you have to shake them anyway. Yeah, it says but, it's natural. But the specifically the ones that had expired, really separated. yes, they were really really separated. And they were like clear up at the top. So so just look at the dates, and that's not Naked's fault. That's you know the people at Kroger that aren't looking at the dates. But I just want you to know that because I want you to be aware. Um, but we bought a lot of these. Mm -hmm. I think we bought enough to have four videos. So because um, yeah, we didn't want to drink like eight of these at once. <laughs> no. Um, no, we've, there's like, there's a lot of them. Uh, not all of them have four. Some of them only have three, I think, in the, in the video. But yeah, I've split them up so that it's more manageable for mm -hmm. us. But if you enjoyed this video and hearing about them, we're going to be doing more. But I'm really impressed. Yeah. I'm excited. I was scared of orange because I was thinking the uh, it's going to be carrot or something. Yeah. It's not. It's mango. It's a very strong mm -hmm. mango. You know, all these are very nice fruit. Yeah, fruits. when we bought these, we were both kind of like, eh, we'll try them, but we don't know. I'm really excited for the rest of them now. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.